So the other day I re-downloaded Crossfire X just before the shutdown happened. A couple weeks ago I tried playing. I waited over an hour and I couldn't find a single game with all the game modes selected. But this time I did find a match. I got a single game in. And after that I could not find another match. And then I uninstalled Crossfire X permanently. I've made it pretty clear I actually welcomed the game being delisted a year after it came out, in my opinion, this shitty player base and fan base, on top of all the dumbass developers, deserved it 100%. Between the stream snipers, low player population, and not to mention all the issues that added up over time on this game, the BS payout system, money hungry devs that made the black market what it is, which is nothing but a big joke, I mean, 15 months in, I never could get that gold diamond Kakuri blade. I'm glad this game is gone. Let this be a lesson once again. You cannot replicate or copy Counter-Strike in any way. Many have tried, many have failed. At the end of the day, Counter-Strike has been going strong for 20 years. They got it done right. Everybody else got it way wrong. We saw it happen with Warface, Rogue Company, Crossfire X, and plenty of other shittier games that couldn't get it done right. Why? Because these developers are thinking like a CEO. Most of these games, if not all of them, were pure cash grabs. They put money before content. And that is just a recipe for disaster in the long run for the players and for the games. Anyways, I'm going to cut it short. I don't want to spend any more time talking about a dead game that diminished my high hopes a little over a year ago. I really wanted this game to work out in the beginning, I really did, but I'm cool with the fate it deserved. The only thing I'm really salty about at the end of it is that they never gave me my refund. So enjoy the remaining gameplay, I'll catch you guys later, thanks for watching.
Mission success. Global risk win.